you're going to do this because I don't want to die of cancer. Chris Weir of Fargo is trying to raise awareness after being diagnosed with colon cancer when she was 43. That used to be rare for people that age. New research shows colon cancer is on the rise in people under 50. Valley News Team's Melanie Palmer explains what the woman wants you to do to get ahead of this very serious form of cancer. There were um, two cancerous tumors growing inside of my colon. Chris Weir is no stranger to cancer. First, she had endometrial cancer, and then later down the road, it was in her colon. She was diagnosed with colon cancer at 43. I start having, you know, just bloody stools, you know, signs and symptoms of what could have been hemorrhoids or just anything. Weir tells us since she was under 50, the doctor did not suggest a colonoscopy. But she says she knew something wasn't right and demanded one. I had to ask for it because I was under 50 and I said, listen, I've already had cancer once. Weir is just one of many patients that are changing the face of colon cancer. Research shows cases among people 50 and older going down. But for people like Weir who are under 50, those rates are going the wrong direction. A lot of different factors. It's not so much age anymore because cancer doesn't discriminate. A new study reveals a reason for the increase isn't that easy to explain. Some research says people could be messing up their guts with antibiotics or a more modern diet. It does say high cancer risk. Yep. Okay. As for Weir, she is now cancer free. She had to go through yeah. rounds of chemotherapy and her colon was removed. I have nothing left. I have an ileostomy bag now but I'm alive. But Weir's not letting in that fact, slow her down. She still works full time and eats a normal diet. And she tells us she's had some major support through this whole journey. You know, I don't know where I'd be if I didn't have my faith and you know, the Lord standing beside me through it all. But now she wants to help others. Be proactive, talk to your doctor, explain your situation, get a colonoscopy done. Weir tells us if you ever have symptoms similar to hers or cancer is common in your family, Talk to your doctor. She says she is forever thankful she did and asked for that colonoscopy. In Fargo, Melanie Palmer, Valley News Live. Colon cancer is the fourth most common cancer and the second deadliest type of cancer behind lung cancer. People around.